Hello there. Uh, good morning. Uh, this, welcome to the ICT Games um, dollop, Daily Dollop of Maths. Uh, this is day four. Um, uh, please make sure you're sat with a family member and you've got a piece of paper ready. Um, and this is uh, lessons for a year one and two class. OK, here we go. So I'm going to start at 12 and we're going to count in tens, counting on in tens, 10 more each time. 12, 22, 32, 42, 52, 62. 72, 82, 92, 102. What do you notice? What doesn't change? What stays the same? Yeah, the units digit. The units digit is the same each time. It's the tens digit that's going up by one, by, or by ten each time. Okay, here we go. Let's try another one. Counting in tens. We'll start at five. Five, 15, 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75, 85, 95, 105. Okay, right, we're gonna now let's have a look. So let's just choose a random number in the middle here. What is this number going to be? If the tens, if we're gonna add 10 to come down here and this digit is gonna stay the, the same, this uh, one's digit is gonna stay the same, what's this number going to be? Turn your partner. That's right, 57. Let's try another one. Let's just uh, cl clear it all and hide it again. Uh, what about this digit here? We've got 55. What's 10 more than 55? This digit is going to go up by 1, by 110. This is going to go up, oh, it's, sorry, it's going to stay the same. 65. Fantastic. Right. Now, 38. What's 10 more than 38? Fantastic. 48. Let's try a puzzle. Okay, now, so we've got 2. Now, we've been doing this already. What's 10? That's a tricky one, actually, because teens are mean. There's a, there's a clue. What number is going to be in here? 12. Fantastic. 10 more than 12? 22. Now this, is this one more? Is it one less? It's going to be one more. So this is one more than 22? One more than 23? One more than 24? Okay. Easy ones. One more than two? One more than three? Fantastic. Okay. Now we're going to go on to something we did in the last session. So this is uh, the rhyme for remembering um, all the numbers that make 10. Here we go. So um, uh, uh, we're going to say it together. So here we go. 10 and 0, you're a hero. 1 and 9, feeling fine. And just put a little thumbs up. 2 and 8, feeling great. Two thumbs up. 3 and 7, made in heaven. And make a little, um, uh, little halo on your head. 4 and 6, let's do some tricks. Make a hat with that arm. And a rabbit with the other. Five and five, let's do a jive. And then you can dance about. Right, okay, my turn and then your turn. So I'll say it first and then you say it back. Please do say it though. Ten and zero, you're a hero. One and nine, feeling fine. Two and eight, feeling great. Three and seven, made in heaven. Four and six, let's do some tricks. Five and five, let's do a jive. Fantastic, guys. Right, okay. Let's see if we can remember some of those. So, let's think um, Think of a way that you could make 10. This, here's my whole, here's my parts. So, how could I make 10? Let's have a look. I'm going to start with 2. 2 and mm, feeling great. What's this number going to be? 2 and mm, feeling great. 2 and 8. Fantastic. 2 and 8. I uh, believe let's take these off. Right, what about oh, sorry, 3? What do you add to 3? 3 and mm, mm, mm. Three and mm, mm, made in heaven. Three and seven. Fantastic. Three and seven made in heaven. Okay, let's try another one. Oh, get this right in the end. Oh dear. Mm, and six. Let's do some tricks. What's that number going to be? Mm, and six. Let's do some tricks. Four. Well done, guys. Fantastic. Okay. Let's move on to something else. Right. So when we were looking at the number square, I'll just quickly flash back to the number square. When we were looking at this and we were going down a square, we were saying it was 10 more each time. We're going to do the same, but with these um, tens and units. OK, so let's have a look at this number first here. I've got two tens. Whoops, shouldn't have said that. Let you work it out. What's that number? Perhaps you could write it down and show your partner. OK, yeah, it's tw uh, two tens, 23. Now I'm going to add another 10. 10 more than 23. Here comes the 10 more. What would that number be? You could perhaps write it with your finger in the air. 
33. That's right. So now we've got 33. Here comes another 10. It was 33. What's with that? If I add 10 more, what will that be? This digit isn't changing, is it? This is staying the same. It's now 43. Let's add another 10. So 43 add 10. Here we go. Here comes another 10. Comes another 10. 10, 20, 30, 40, 53. Okay, right, I'm going to take a 10 away now. So I've got 53, 50 and 3, and I'm going to take 10 away. Take away 10, 10 less. How much is there now? 43, 43. Right, 10 less than 43. Here we go, 10 less than 43. 33. Okay, fantastic. Now, let's have a look. So we're going to move on to something else. There we go. So I've got some balances, some scales here. If I put a number on it, let's just to clear that. Let's put eight there and eighteen there. Okay. When I switch it on, it's going to um, test for which one uh, uh, has the most uh, is the larger number. Okay. So eight is fewer than eighteen. Eight is smaller than eighteen. Okay. Right. I'm going to clear it now. So if I put in here eight, and I put in 18 take away 10. 8 and 18 take away 10. If I switch this on, watch what's going to You might know what's going to happen. It's quite a tricky one, this one. They're actually both the same. It didn't change at all. They balance. 8 is equal to 18 take away 10. That was really tricky, actually, to be fair. That was a really year 2 -y thing to do. All right, here we go. We're going to try another one. We're going to try 25 take away 10. And on the other side, we're going to have 2 add 20. Hmm. I haven't turned it on yet, so it's not, we are, we're, not, we're, not, we're just wondering which way it's going to go. 25 take away 10. 10 less than 25. Think about what that number is going to be. You might want to write that down. And then 2 add 20. Okay. Now this one uh, is going to be one. Uh, it's going to be ten less. It's going to be fifteen. This one is going to be twenty-two. So uh, twenty-five take away ten is fewer than is less than two add twenty. Let's try another one. Okay. We've got thirty-six take away ten, and on the other side we're just going to have twenty-seven. Which way? Which side is going to go down? Which side is is larger which side is greater if you know that perhaps which what's the symbol going to be in here okay you're going to ready three two one we'll turn it on because mm, 36 take away 10 is going to be 26 so 26 is fewer than 27 okay let's go on to something else Right, now we did a little bit of this before. I'm going to turn off the hour hand. We said the minute hand counts in fives, five guys. Are you ready? So we're going to count in fives. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, or zero. We say zero. I'm going to put my numbers on so we can see them. Let's try that again. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, or oh, 0. Okay, right now, I'm going to put my hour hand on. I'm going to just uh, change the time a bit. Okay, hurry up, please, Mr. Clock. Bear with me a second. This is going to be about, oh, I think just before, right, okay, so we're at 10 o'clock. We're at 10 o'clock at the minute. Okay, so the long hand is on the uh, 12, and the minute hand is on the 12, and the hour hand is pointing directly at 10. What time will it be in an hour's time? 11 o'clock. Fantastic. Right. It's 11 o'clock. We're having our break. And then we, uh, we go uh, for a walk. And we get back two hours later. Two hours later than 11 o'clock. It was 11 o'clock. Two hours later. That's one hour. Two hours. What time is that? OK, fantastic. One o'clock now. So it's one o'clock and we have some lunch and we eat our lunch for a whole hour. What time is it going to be? After our lunch. Two o'clock. OK, now. So after two o'clock, we all feel a bit dozy. So we have a sleep under a tree. OK, and we sleep for two hours. 
time is it going to be after two hours? What time is that? Fantastic, four o'clock. Okay, guys, super job. We're going to finish with our game. Here we go. So let's try. Let's try numbers between 91 and 110. Here we go. Right, so here we go. So if you th so uh, we've got 104. We've got numbers between 91 and 110. So if you think it's going to be higher than 104, shout higher. If you think it's going to be lower than 104, shout lower. Okay, right. So 104. Hmm, that's kind of in the middle. Makes it tricky, doesn't it? Because there's almost as many numbers here as there are there, but there are more here. So I'm going to say lower. Let's have a look. Oh, never mind. Okay. Well, there's very few here, so I'm going to go lower. Fantastic. Okay, what do you reckon now? What do you think? It's quite tricky, isn't it? Because there's, there's, there's just almost just as many numbers there as there are there left now. Uh, so we can go either way. I'm just going to pot, go for potluck and go lower. Yes! We're lucky there. Did you go lower as well? Okay, right, 96. We're at 96. What do you think now? I'm going to go higher. Oh, oh, oh dear. Okay, right now, this is quite easy. Why is this easy? Yeah, because there's only one less, isn't there? So I'm going to go higher. Yes. What did I win? Ooh, I won a smoothie maker. What a fabulous prize. Okay, guys, you're awesome. Uh, right, so um, let's have a think. What should our, our reward be? Let's get, get a little uh, packet. Uh, and in that, you've got a, a, some chips. What I want you to do is open the lid on your ketchup and put some ketchup on your chips get it out because it's it's hard to get the ketchup out okay there's a dollop out right put some a little bit of salt on it and then a little bit of vinegar and then take one and eat the lot guys you're awesome uh, thank you for coming and listening um, if you want anything else to do here you can pause your screen now here there's some year one activities here and then some year two activities so if you pause the screen now um, you could have a go at those activities um, uh, if your family want you to. Uh, thanks for coming uh, and well done, guys. Uh, see you tomorrow.